Nat 20. Welcome back to Nat 20, everyone. We're in our previous episode, our adventures, we're battling a bunch of Rodrikin in the depths as they're trying to save a bunch of prisoners who are pretty much being, being used as slave labor. Uh, so we last, our last person who went in the fight was a Rudderkin who was tossed down into the large pit. So next it'll be Lazarus. Cool. How far away are those Rudderkin that are on the same level as me? They'd probably be around 60 feet away, 90 feet away, and 120 feet away now. Okay. Where am I? I'm going to cast Slayer's Prey on the one that's 60 feet away. It's a bonus action. So I do 1d6 on any attack against it. Okay, cool. And then I'll just try to shoot it with my longbow. Okay. Oh, I hate these dice. That's that's a 7. Yeah, that's that does not hit. Uh, so next, I'll, unless there's something else you want to do, I'll go to Rodderkin number 3. No, I can't do anything else. Okay, so this one is going for Lazarus again. I mean, so, Aylor and all again. I always got D2 mix up for some reason. Oh, that's because they're both edgy. <laughs> uh, he Shut misses his attack. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we next have it lighters. Is Baron. Yay! Uh, so where are the bad guys? Uh, there's one that's uh, attacking uh, Aylor and all, and that's the only one around you, and then there are two others coming from out here. And here. You guys are about here. They're on the same level as this now, right? I'm going to... I don't know. I'm cast... Uh, run. <laughs> I cast Run Away. <laughs> hey, he's within five feet. Uh, and, uh, you could go... Yeah, it would be within five feet of Ale Yeah. Oops. Okay, let's not do that. Uh, I'm just going to Ray of Frost him then. Okay. Watch out for the gnome. <laughs> Shut up! Don't save your life. I don't know what that is. I'm gonna count it as a 7. That was showing my sword some of this. What a deal? That's not 19 plus 2, so yeah, it's 21. Sweet, okay. Um, good old D. Oh, that's 4 damage. Cool damage. 4 damage, so that is 2 full damage. Oh. Okay. <laughs> I guess I'll try some other spells. Ah, they're resistant! Mm hmm. The cold hand fire. Yeah. Sounds like a Rodderkin to me. Sounds like a jack of war. Uh, uh, next is the yeah. another Rodderkin that is down below. He's just gonna get ready to. He's gonna run over to the Bulgura to like motion that. <laughs> uh, he should not do that. That's the one that I pushed off. Yeah. Far away is he? Uh, ladder. He'd be mean, like right prone? at the bottom of the ladder, probably. Okay. Drop it down. We even pro. He got like fucking like flung off the ladder. I, then, fine, he gets up and he walks towards the Rudderkin. Okay. <laughs> Thanks for trying, Clay. Thanks, well, it's just because if they were prone, he wouldn't be able to go anywhere. His whole movement would be standing up. Oh, well, half his movement. Yeah, half his movement. Oh, half his movement? Yeah. Yeah. Damn it, the Bulgur is so close. I forgot. It's cool. It's not too, too close. The Bulgur is in the center of the room, which is probably around uh, 40-ish feet yeah. to the center. Drop your hammer. Can I go? Uh, yeah, it's your turn now. Okay, okay, so here's what's gonna happen. I'm gonna draw the battle hammer. <laughs> You're crossing the that one. <laughs> and I'm gonna jump off the ladder and try and land on top of him. As I'm falling, I'm gonna put my ladder, or my. <laughs> I'm gonna put my battle hammer down and put my feet on the head, like, you know, Link when he's doing his yeah. down air and smash. And I'm gonna aim right. For the rudder can see if I can land on top of him and crush. Oh no, okay. shielded! <laughs> Not Donkey Kong. Spot dodge. What? Not the giant monkey ape thing. I don't think I could. He's like he's like in the middle of the cavern. Yeah. I, I he, that, he'd need a good. I thought that other guy. Don't to have he's running to him, but he oh, he's out there. Yeah. Made a good <laughs> really dumb. Okay. okay. Sorry. Never mind. What do you want me to do? Uh, uh roll a. Uh, I'll give you a choice. You can either roll to hit, or you can roll a acrobatics check. I'm very acrobatic. <laughs> mm, they both give me plus zero, so... I'd say... That is a nine. How do you have a plus zero to hit? Oh, well, sorry. Is it strength to hit or dex to hit? Uh, it'd, it'd be strength. Strength, okay. Yeah. So that is a twelve. And that's plus your proficiency? Yeah. And your strength? Yeah. 
12 extra hits. Oh my <laughs> god! That's, that's what he needed to hit. That's amazing. <laughs> oh shit. Okay. I'm gonna die now, though. Yeah. <laughs> uh, it's totally worth it. Roll for... You can... So you definitely land on him and you hit him. And then roll damage times three. Okay. Battle hammer damage? Yeah. Oh, you're gonna crush this skull. I, I will also have to... I will... Or you were about 15 feet down oh, that, 15 right? Feet 15 feet, ladder, feet. yeah. Okay. And so, that's from where you jumped from, right? Uh, yeah, I jumped right from okay. there. So I'll roll half the dice that I would need it since he's kind of cushioning your fall okay. a little bit. And then would this count as a one-handed hit or two-handed hit? Because 1d8 or 1d10? Two-handed. Two-handed. Okay. <laughs> so you're putting all your weight behind. Wow, this right. one actually relatively well for you. This is really good. <laughs> nice, man. Nineteen damage. Nineteen damage. I just deflect myself to catch you. This is the one that you charm to climb down, right? That is, yes. <laughs> He's still alive. <laughs> he has one hit point. Are you kidding me? <laughs> he has okay. one. You need That's fine. Point. You should go to action of Um, and and do you add your like? Oh, bonus? I did not add my strength bonuses. So that's plus three on top of that. You feel sick. He wow. still has one HP. So, no. <laughs> How exactly do you do this? Okay, I just, I'm gonna come down right on top of his head, and like his head's gonna explode, <laughs> and his body's gonna kind of crumple, and like his rib cage pops open, and, okay. oh. and then I just gracefully land. I think you would hope to land. This isn't it. actually like smasher. <laughs> Yeah, when it like bounces on the sword. <laughs> yeah. No, but I'm just gonna just gonna crush him. You will take ten damage from the ball. That's fine. I haven't taken any damage yet, so. <laughs> Sick. Gnarly. You think we can get the same thing if we jump down? <laughs> <laughs> you just no. want them one of the slaves. I'll cushion your fall. <laughs> I'm gonna do it to the dark room. Uh, next is monster. Lovecraft. Lovecraft trying to look at looking at you and what to do. Uh, I think that the ladder. Yeah, right? uh, you are now at the bottom of the ladder. Uh, are you trying to go after the one that's still with them, or one of the others that's charging towards them? Uh, who wants or to go them? for a uh, Ryan type move? No, I'm not going to tell him to jump off the ledge. <laughs> no, I'm going Crawl to the Caldura. <laughs> no, I'm going to tell him to. He rush. still doesn't know we're here somehow. <laughs> Does anyone have a monster yeah. manual? No. Yeah. You need the wolf thing? Yeah, it's wolf. Uh, 2d4 it. plus 2. Well, I want to know his moves. It's basically just bite, I think. Yes, his only thing is bite. Oh, he yeah. doesn't have pass. He does have packed tactics, though. So advantage of he's within 5 feet of uh, ally. He's definitely within 5 feet of me. Uh, yeah, I'll just have him go for the one that's uh, beside us. That's rushing us, right? That's rushing. Okay. okay. Uh, so just roll to it for him. 20, 30, 20. 20. Yeah, you definitely hits. Okay, cool. What's this? Uh, 2d4 plus 2 piercing damage. Uh, 4. Plus the strength, right? 2d4 plus 2. So, oh. So 6. So 6. 6, okay. Yeah, I'll just sit up and be like, rush forward and then like, lunge. I'll have him like, bite you guys in the face or something. Yeah, so now. Like that. And he's got to make a strength save or be knocked prone. Okay. DC 11. You got a 15. Okay. Or a 17, I guess. Did you wolf train Good boy luck. Shut up. Good boy luck, crap. I can't change the suit, you see? Train what maybe you can. Make him stronger. He's, he's, give you him told some me I can't have him digivolve, so that means I can't train him like a Pokemon, okay? It's no. Give him like a Pokemon. Train him like an animal. But no, that just it doesn't work. Like, I can just make his DC better. Give him like protein shakes and whatever. <laughs> <laughs> really Here, love crap, drink this. <laughs> it's G fuel. <laughs> make him swell. <laughs> I don't know, make him do target practice or something. Uh, so Alcaro is next, so he's going to help with the attacking guy who's been attacking you guys for the last oh, episode. You guys are doing great. Yeah, yeah. Uh, you can teach a lot of hold up great. Uh, there's Lost one more yeah. with the, the you guys, yeah. and then there's two coming along, and the wolf just attacked one of them that is coming to you guys. You just uh, said this isn't and Dark Souls. <laughs> 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 or Lazarus. Where's the coffee? What's that? Oh, I was just saying there's three more up above with you. Okay, Come yeah. On, please. Uh, so Alcaro is attacking please. the one that attacked you. He got a uh, 21. Uh, he'll do... Yippee! Uh, he does 25 damage. Wow. Dude! I'm getting that sword. No, you're not. 
Please don't. He's actually this guy's actually like kicking the major. But I'm not gonna kill him. I'm just gonna take his sword. Oh no! I think you're with a bunch of good guys on your party. Yeah. And if you steal a sword, you excuse me. You're a good guy. Yeah. And he's gonna do a Two second attack. I forgot that he could do multi attack. So. Okay. You're yes. So I think I'm also can. Well, you forgot. Yeah. Uh, he kills him. Sweet. Good thing he came to the rescue. Okay. And next it will be Blaze. Uh, I will follow Lovecraft. Okay. Yeah. And I'm going to like. Uh. I'm gonna rush and I'm gonna like jump over Lovecraft and I'll use them as like a springboard so I'll like push on them with my feet and just like stab my two daggers right into the sort of his face. I uh, just want to snap his spine. No, I don't weigh 300 pounds. I mean, it's a wolf. You can definitely support me. Uh, yeah, you're just able to barely get to where this Roger King is. Well, how far away was he? He was uh, 35 feet away. Oh, okay, yeah, I'll use my two daggers again. Okay. I'm like stab him in both his eyes. I'm gonna try and blind him. Oof. Uh, 16 and uh, 14. Both it? Oh, wait, that's actually. Oh, that's not bad. What? What? No, no, it's fine. What? What are you laughing at? I just. Uh, no, I, I feel like you should have re rolled that one, but it's okay. Why? What's wrong with it? Well, no, it was like it was, like, was kind of on the one and kind of on the other. It was kind of like the higher one, but. No, I, I don't know. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> just. Okay, whatever. I'm sorry. The first thing I saw was the 10. Five! Oh, uh, no, this is actually a four. What was I thinking? <laughs> <laughs> no, uh, so the first one is. Uh, mm. This one is eight. Wait, that doesn't make sense, clean. No. Oh, yeah, it is, because 24 plus 3 plus my death. So, but that one is only a 2. So, 10. 10. Okay, nice. Okay, still alive. Uh, next is uh, Ale Rimmel. Alright. So, there's that one that's right by us, right? That, um, what's the space attack? The only ones still alive near you are the one that's near Blaze, and then there's one coming up from the other side. So, there's one about, about here now. You are here. So, okay. that would be probably around 30. Five, four, no, about like 40 feet away. Um, or 50 feet away. Uh, um, I'm gonna shoot him with my longbow. Okay. The one on the side or the one with Blaze? Uh, the one on the, the side. Okay. The one that's not with Blaze. Uh, that's an 18. Hey, you definitely hit. Woo wee! Uh, so that is a 1d8. Uh, that is 12. Cool. Nice. Yes. yes, sir. Um... Who's been else on your turn? I'm gonna use another one of my hit die and try to regain some points. Okay, uh, next is the one that you knocked down to the bottom of the pit. He's gonna get up. So he's not prone anymore. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> and make his way towards the Bulgura. Quick, climb back up the ladder and jump on that one too. Okay? <laughs> so he's only able to get 10 feet uh, closer. So okay. he's still about 20 feet away. I have proven that it can be done. I'll do it. Cool. <laughs> or 30 feet away, I guess. I'm happy to jump on top of this. Actually, I only have 15 points. Not gonna do I'm going to jump from the top ropes. And so it is your turn now, uh, Lazarus. Except instead of, uh, cause you're the fire Eldrin, so you gotta do it like, misty step fire, like, in Shinroar. Like, I'll be okay. Just do a running long jump and then face step in the middle of the, middle of the air and straight into him. It literally in Shinroar's cool. move! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I love it! <laughs> uh, actually I might do that. <laughs> yeah! I think that'd be hilarious. There's still the three Redican on the top level, right? Yeah. How far away is the closest one? The closest one would probably be about 30 feet away from me now. Okay. Is there anyone left on the second level? Uh, there's one here, or one here, and one here. This one is near Blaze and Alcaro. This one was just attacked by Alien Doll with an arrow. Okay. And then there's one down here, and then the Bulgar is right here. You're so screwed. So. How far out is it to the center from top left? Uh, so from here to here would be 40 feet. Then mm -hmm. from here to here would be 50 feet. So it's only 90 feet down. We can only teleport 30. <laughs> <laughs> as long as it's part of the way. Can you cast I, jump on yourself? 
No. Uh, I can't really do much to help any of you guys, so I'll just keep helping the people on the top level, I guess. Yeah, run 30 feet towards the guy closest to me and use my long swords. Okay. I wish I could do a quill cool maneuver, but too far away. Oh, uh, happen. It's okay. So 18 and a uh, 11. Uh, 18 hits. 9 for the long sword, and then also a d6. Plus 5, so 14. 14? Uh, next is. Next, I'll go to the one that Blaze attacked. Uh, he'll attack you. Uh, nat 20. And he's fighting you. You'll take 29 damage. Oh, piercing him. Shit. I'm unconscious. Ooh. It's like, fall. Well, I'm like, ah! And I, like, throw up two middle fingers as I fall to the ground. Do a constitution saving throw, please. But I'm oh, unconscious! Also, with that, <laughs> not just outright kill him. What? Isn't it half? No, it has to be your full damage. Full? Yep. Okay. I rolled an 11. Are you happy I took a little bit Yeah, no, I'm going to say a word. Saving throw? Yeah, it's plus zero. Constitution, right? Gage. I don't want to do this. Gage! Oh my god! Wait, no. are they actually gonna die? <laughs> oh god! Oh, what happens if? Mm. <laughs> when the DM says I don't want to do this, is that? Hey. What happens, Gage? Uh, I'll read right this out. out. Oh, okay. 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 Uh. Just an innocent little cat man. <laughs> On a fail, they become. If they fail against the disease, they can become poisoned, and at the end of each long rest, the poison target can take and repeat the same throw, and in the effect on itself works a success. If the target is reduced to zero hit points while poisoned in this way, it dies and instantly transforms into a living abyssal wretch. But he didn't go down to zero from the poison. Well, I am poisoned, and I'm at zero hit points, which means I'm dead? Uh, you are transforming into an abyssal wretch. Fuck is an abyssal wretch. I'm not sure if this is it or not. No. I'm not sure if that's No, because I looked at Rudderkin on my or... phone. I want to see what they look like. That's okay. a picture of the Rudderkin. Okay. No, that's... Oh, man. Blaze is dead? It can be undone. It can be? Yeah. How? With a whiff. <laughs> Oh my god, Are you joking? Geez. Are you kidding I'll, I'll, I'm gonna figure something out for this, though. So I don't have to worry. Wow, nice idea. So, hey, there's no people that can actually die. That's cool. Let's just bring him back. I thought it was going to do, like, necrotic damage or something, and then I just outright kill him. But so, like, it said it would be from the poison, so, like, isn't that if the, the actual, um, if he actually does from the poison damage? Cause he yeah, had... instead of just the hit. No, it's just if you uh, are reduced to zero points while poisoned in this way. But he does the convo after he gets hit. He does a con con throw when he's hit. It happens. It's, a it's like bite. A, a, a snake bite. If uh, the snake bites you, uh, you're gonna yeah. get poison. Oh yeah, we're just trying to help you. Man. No, I understand. <laughs> it's cool. I have like six characters on the side. <laughs> I was just really looking forward to this one. <laughs> I'll figure something out for him. Like I'll talk to you after this session, and we'll figure something out. Uh, so next will be. Uh, Come on, man, see you're racing on the stats for that. <laughs> <laughs> uh, next will be the Rudderkin that's with oh, you, Zach. Uh, it's gonna attack you, Zach. It's heavy little thing. Got a, <laughs> <laughs> Got a 19. Can I play How Could This Happen to Me Again? Yeah. <laughs> We're probably not because, yeah. Yeah. Even oh. though we really you can see a very point. poor addition of <laughs> it, though. Uh, it'll take 14 <laughs> damage. Yo, Quang, can you become... roll a constitution check, please? Where I right. succeed. What thing? I'm just saying that my recording. I got a 13. Oh, That's what you needed. Um, so you're good. Yo, just become a revenant. <laughs> <laughs> I like being a tabaxi monk. <laughs> uh, next, it will be Theron. I'm going to acid splash the thing close to me. Okay, so there's one here and there's one here. Which are you going to? Because the one here is the one that Blaze is fighting, the one here is the one that La I mean, Aylor and all fired an arrow at. I'm gonna go to the one where Blaze was fighting. Okay. Do you have the Cloak of Featherfall or whatever? Yeah, you do, I think. Yeah. 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 Just wondering. 
<laughs> so Dazzy to you cast Feather Ball as a reaction with the cape. Oh, that's Once right. per day. I just remember that it blew in the wind. <laughs> <laughs> and I couldn't do the black. Uh, uh, just redo it. But yeah. Yeah, I see a real cool. Sorry, man. Uh, that is. Uh, one, two. Oh, no, it's a deck save. Never mind. I didn't even have to roll. Deck save 14. Frost and Splash. Oh, I have to do the deck save. Okay, sorry, sorry. Splash is just rolling from the uh, He got a, a 10, so he fails. Yeah, alright, is this 1d6? Remember when I made that joke when I said, Oh, Gage, who are you going to kill next? Four acid damage. Four, uh. Did you take it a little too seriously? <laughs> yeah. no, He's like, awesome. he you took, know, actually... He took that as a challenge. <laughs> He's like, I'm not going to kill him. I'm going to make him turn into a demon. That is kind of, like, uh, such a such a scary mm. thing when the DM says he doesn't yeah. like, want to do it. Do this. <laughs> He's a little too upset just about fuck these guys. <laughs> uh, was there anything else you want to do on your turn? Uh, I, can do. I feel like, like we should open the portal already. Can you do me a favor? Just cash for me. I would really appreciate that. Uh, next will yeah. be. It's wish really hard. Wish on a sh- uh, shooting star. <laughs> next is another Rodokun on your level, but it's the one on the opposite, opposite side, so it can't get to you yet. There's so many. Uh, then. Ryan. Okay. Um. I don't want to engage with the demon baby or demon monkey. Like <laughs> demon baby. No, it's demon, a demon baby. Demon baby. <laughs> yeah. Is he not? Has he noticed us yet? Uh, he is not. Just because he is below you guys and all this stuff that's happening okay. above. And there's no Rodokin down here. There's one Rodokin. There's one Rodokin. It's Rodokin? running towards the Belgrade. Okay, I'm going to chase him. It's 10 feet away from the ladder. Okay. So I'll cast Searing Smite. On my battle armor as a bonus action. Okay. And then I'm just gonna run up and smack him with it. And that's 16 to hit. Yeah, you hit. And I don't remember what series weight is an extra 1d6, I think. Two handed. Cool. 11 damage. And he has to make a con save, DC 15. Uh, it failed. Okay, so he's on fire then and takes 1d6 fire damage until um, he puts it out. Does he take the damage this turn too? No, just next turn. Okay. He is not looking good at all. Uh, at the start of each of its turns until the spell ends, he takes the fire damage, which is a minute. Uh, so next is the one that Lazarus fired an arrow at. It's just going to keep running towards him. Sir, Aeron, Aeron, and all. Fucking hell. Uh, so it can't do anything this turn. Uh, and then Lovecraft is going to. Uh, Lovecraft's just gonna attack it. Engines. Yeah. I mean, I'd rather you kill me than my dog. Yeah, it's me dead. <laughs> is Lovecraft gonna yes. recognize you? I mean, if it's a wretch, <laughs> I don't yeah. think I will be recognizable. Is it? Like, I think it's instant? where I'm basically turning into a demon. Like a malformed like, yeah. monstrosity. It sounds like something like that, yeah. Uh, Lovecraft right? does 7 damage. And then he has to make like a strength saving throw? Yeah. And he is not prone. Yippee. Uh, next is Alcaro. He's just gonna, uh, end, end this man's career. <laughs> <laughs> Are those his words? <laughs> uh, he hits and kills it. Wow. Uh, he just swings his lawns, his, uh, shadow, or demon's bane crosswise, and, or horizontally, and just chops its head off. I don't think I'm going to get that sword. <laughs> you have to buy one, basically. Oh. You might die by that sword, though. <laughs> but I admit, I will get it after all, in the stomach. And he's just looking down at you, wondering what the hell to do at this moment. I would speak, but I'm also unconscious. Is it? How fast is the transformation? Uh, oh, it dies and instantly transforms into an, a living abyssal wretch. Of course it's instantly. <laughs> Can we re-kill Clayton now? <laughs> I don't know, if you're gonna attack us, I don't know what we're gonna do. Can I have the stats for it? Is, is, that that it? is he yeah. undead? He would Fuck be off! Undead. Stop sliding to kill probably would be undead. <laughs> CR probably isn't that high. Class, armor class of 11, hit point of 18. 
I am resistant to cold fire lightning. I'm immune to poison. Challenge is one. I'm more. immune to being charmed, frightened, or poisoned. Uh, I don't know why I just did damage. Oh, good damage. Okay. I can't speak, but I understand the whistle. Uh, so for your turn, Blaze, you are just going through this transformation. Do I wake up? Uh, you you wake up and you look at yourself and you seem completely different. <sighs> well, quite a bit different. Like you have. Re- your flesh is already starting to rot. You blood isn't really leaking through you, but some like pus is and stuff like that, and just various fluids. Does it change like my personality or my alignment? Because I don't say anything about that. A uh, living abyssal wretch. I don't think because then it just would. says the transformation of the body can be yeah. undone. So I'm not sure if it means like I can just I have to look like an abyssal wretch. I have think all their stats, or if I, I... think you would just be an Abyssal Wretch, so you'd still be able to do what you want to do. I'm an Abyssal Wretch. Oh. Okay. Hey, you can blend in a bit of Balrog, or Algor, or whatever it is. Balrog. Balrog, my bad. Ah, I'm not transformed! Come on, my bad! Uh, is there anything you want to do on your turn then, Blaze? Can I look like the Revocant so I can have a hand? Oh, sure. uh, mouth hand? <laughs> <laughs> I'm a mouth hand! I think I'm gonna skip my turn because I have a mild panic attack. Okay. Yeah. Uh, One third of a party is now undead. That's cool. No, I'm not undead. I'm a demon. I'm a fiend. Oh, you're not undead? Oh, I'm just a fiend. Uh, next would be oh. Ail Riddle. Okay. Like zombie uh, zombie looking. Like a zombie looking. I'm gonna. Came back. I'm gonna. I think I'm gonna go at. So there's still the one right here. Yeah. Before. And there's the one down <laughs> here with <laughs> Ryan. Yeah. Ryan. Uh, Necromorph zombies. And then besides that, there's just I that. Um, what's his name? Uh, the Barl Gura. And then there's there's still a bunch of oh, like the question was slaves. What's his name. Yeah. There's <laughs> there's <laughs> also three Roger Kin up here. Uh, and two Shardana, One here. One here. And probably some here. You know, we're not doing too bad. Besides Blaze, I mean. <laughs> I feel Sorry, like, I mean, uh, the rest of us are doing fine. I feel like maybe I should go down in that pit and then open the... Featherfall and portal, yeah, that's probably a good idea. Yeah. Can I go down on Do- Donkey Kong? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, I guess I'll... I guess... Uh, how far can I Featherfall? Uh, it's the same as this doll. Uh, as long as you're keeping I'll find it real quick because I got an index. Okay. Holy shit, there it is. We'll all have one minute. Up to five falling creatures full range, but it's probably only on himself, I yeah. guess. Yeah. Rate of descent slows to 60 feet per round till the spell ends. If this creature lands before the spell ends, you take no falling damage. So it's a minute. Okay. Um, and you said how, it was 50 feet from here? Uh, it's 50. From here to here, like the distance here to here, or the depth here? From here into the, the depth part. Yeah, uh, it is, is 50. 70 feet deeper yeah. than here. So you can get there in like a round in a bit. Yeah. Can you say it was 50 last time? No, you said we were so it's was. distance yeah. wise. Where you were at, you were at 50. Oh, but it's 70 feet down. Yeah, okay. Yeah, alright. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna do that, then I'm gonna hop off and feather fall down and okay. try to get down there as fast as I can. If you wanted to, you could slip iron arrow or something. Uh, oh yeah, because I guess it's a bonus action. Yeah. I guess I'll shoot that guy again with my longbow before I hop oh, away. Shoot, shoot the one down below. Shoot the one down below? Because he's going to let the bell go around. Yeah. Oh, that's right. Okay, I'll jump off. He's on fire too, so... And I'm going to sh- I'm gonna shoot my longbow downward, and then I'm going to... Uh, that is a 22. You hit. Nice. I know, that's pretty cool. First time I got over 20 in the last, like, eight rounds, or eight sessions. Eight sessions. Yeah. Uh, I need a... That's a mid-air shot. It's like a Breath of the Wild, which I've yeah, down. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Uh, 11. Yeah, uh, how, or, where are you, I mean, like, how are you trying to come? I'm gonna shoot, sh- like, like, so where is he down here? He'd be probably about here. Oh, so I'm gonna shoot it straight down? Is, is this gonna kill him? Yeah. So the arrow's gonna go right, like... To the top of his head and go straight through his body, right okay. into the, and it's gonna stick in the ground. He's yeah, gonna go right through him. Yeah, uh, that awesome. exact thing happens. <laughs> like, uh, yeah, like, 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 like a loud slow motion. Just go, <laughs> <laughs> you know, you're gonna be like running after him. You just see, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> right, right through his body. Probably thinks he missed. 
<laughs> Damn, I probably missed <laughs> Wow, I'm over <laughs> shot. <laughs> This uh, terrifies me. That's the next one, Sazzers. Oh. Oh. Fuck! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Was there anyone left on the second level? Uh, there's one left right here. And, yeah. Oh, what happened to the one that... Uh, Alcaro killed him. Oh, or, that's right. Alcaro... Yeah, I think Alcaro killed Yeah, him. he ended his career. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Did the explosion we set off do anything? <laughs> it mostly just... Took uh, a uh, bunch of Shredder here. Oh, okay. So one of them probably was just like, "Huh, that doesn't sound good," and walked off, and that was it. So is that Jonathan? <laughs> <laughs> would I be able to go thirty feet close and then teleport to him thirty feet away? Am I close enough to do that? Uh, the range from the level to the level is forty feet. I thought it was thirty. Did I say 30? Okay, it's 30 feet then. So yeah, you would be able to. Okay, and that's a bonus action, so... Yeah, I'll do that. Run up 30 feet, teleport to him as a bonus action with my face step. And explode with fire, and he takes one fire damage. Got him. But since it's a bonus action, I can still attack. So after I teleport in front of his face, I'll slash at him with my long swords. Okay. That's a 10 and a 17. 17 hits. 6 damage. Okay. Still alive. Uh, next is one of the Radikin on the top level. He sees that everyone is down, so he's gonna just jump. And he'll take, as he jumps, he takes 10 damage. He kills himself. <laughs> and then it is Farron's turn. So where's the closest one to me then? Uh, there's one right here that Zach just teleported to and attacked. He's looking moderately badly wounded. Is that within 60 feet? Yep. Okay, I'm gonna just uh, acid splash him. Okay. Another time. Is that a saving throw for me? Yeah, it's a dex saving throw. I'm just gonna hurl it no bomb. Check it like a got a 20. 30, 20. That's stupid. That works. <laughs> That's stupid. Doesn't do half damage or anything? No. Okay. What? Watch is it? Usually that's that, like that. a half, uh, half uh, successful save. No, as a splash is kind of useless. Wow. Mm-hmm. Is there anything else you want to do with the trip? Cast Wish. <laughs> no, there's nothing I can do. Okay. Uh, next will be another one of the upper ones. Again, it's just going to jump down to you guys. Well, he'll take 12 damage from that. And both of those two are prone right now. So Ryan, you're next. Cool. Okay. So the guy I was dying is dead. Um, yeah. So there's one that Bulgar or uh, Barlagura down here. Well, I don't want to engage with him just yet. Or maybe I'll wait for the rest of my party. So uh, they arrive. I'll just look out to see where the arrow came from, and I'm assuming I can see Elrond floating down. Yeah, you see. Floating down. Yeah. Um, he's, he's probably only like 10 feet in the air now, I guess. Yep. Yeah, okay. So I'll just like go over to him, and then I'll be ready to attack the Balgara if uh, he comes and notices us. Okay. So as you look at the Balgara, it just seems a little bit confused as to why there's more prisoners down here. It hasn't seen any guys or isn't like attacking anyone more than normal. Like, it, it was kind of abuse, abusing the prisoners if they weren't doing what, he, what it wanted. Oh, actually, instead of being ready, can I just take my action to douse the body of yeah. the Rudderkin so that it's not like a beacon? Yeah, you're able to do that. Uh, next is Lovecraft. Uh, he's going to run at the one that just jumped down to the middle level, attack, or, uh, Blaze, you can eat, be Lovecraft, because I think you were before. Okay. Still gonna do that. Yeah. <laughs> Plus what? Plus four to hit. So eleven. Eleven. Bad misses. Uh, so next is next is Alcaro. He's gonna attack that same one. Yeah, but well, my character dies. My new character is just love. Uh, <laughs> uh, he kills this prone uh, Rodrikin. Oh shit! Lovecraft had advantage. So just oh, he did. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh. Nice. Yeah. 
That's funny. Yeah, yeah. so just uh, roll 4d4 then. What? What? Shake your hand at me. 2d4? 4d4. Uh, 6 and then 11. Plus 2d4 plus 2. So, so, so 6. So that would have been 11 no. damage then. Plus 4 yeah. No, no, thir- thirteen. Because it was eleven without. I rolled a six for the first two I rolled. Yeah. So that's yeah. plus two. That's eight. You only rolled a five. The modifier is added once it's a critical hit. Yeah. So yeah. thirteen. Yeah. So uh, Lovecraft kills him. Nice. So how do you like Lovecraft to do this? Okay. Uh, uh, I kind of want to just like picture like Twilight Princess. That's Lovecraft. <laughs> he is blinkable. Uh, so let's do like a spin. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> he'll spin out of him, like bite his. Well, he'll bite his neck, and then he'll spin, and like kind of like tear his nice. throat down. Okay, nice. Yeah, he'll like sink his fangs in, and then do like a big like yank with his head, and he's like the body will go one way, but the chunk of throat will go another. <laughs> was that the first one that dropped down, the one that yeah. I was attacking before? Yeah. Okay. And then Alcara is going to attack the the second one. Uh, he he hits with his first attack. I also, and now I'm in this I realize I can't understand combat anymore. I can't really understand the pistol. And I can't talk, so. Does I'll make you understand what I'm trying to tell <laughs> you. How was your day? <laughs> you laminate that through torture. Okay, so he's. Al- or wait, advantage. Uh, the Rodrikin is still alive. Uh, next, it is. Uh, Blaze, what would you like to do? Uh, I don't think I can attack him. Yeah, victims that succumb to the disease experience tremendous pain as their bodies become disfigured, flesh twisting around the bones. Until they transform to join the mass of abyssal wretches that follow in the wake of the Rudderkin mob that laid them low. Ooh. So I actually, I'm like, that guy's my master. Okay. So, um, who's closest to me? Uh, Alcaro, I think. I'm going to attack Alcaro. Okay. <laughs> So he's gonna like cut you down, man. <laughs> you should just give me the fucking sword. Dude. Yeah, <laughs> you're gonna die twice. Uh, okay, so I have a plus three. <laughs> Eight. <laughs> that misses. Uh, so next. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> uh, next is Ailernel. All right, sweet. So you're about ten feet from the ground right now. Okay, and then I can stuff other fall like to right to the ground. Yeah. Right. Sick. Um, and there's no one. There's no like enemies down there, right? Just Besides the Barla Cool. Is that no, right, right there? And he doesn't see us yet, right? Doesn't no. Do that. Sweet. All right, let's keep it that way. Cool. Um, I guess I might as well open the portal now yeah. officially. Yeah. Okay. Start ushering people through. Yeah, so I am going to open the portal. So I, I now press the button. Okay, the portal opens up about five feet in front of you. All right, sick. And this is like a large portal, so it's about like 10 feet by six feet. Nice. Wide. Cool. cool. Sick. <laughs> a Shardana army marches through. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Arnish shows up. Just, you rang. <laughs> Oh, it's you again. <laughs> um, yeah, so now I'm just gonna... Alright, I guess we should start ushering. Yeah, I'm gonna try to usher some of the, the s- slaves. Are you going through first, or are you ushering others through first? Oh. oh. Why um, does he need to know the answer to that? I don't like that smile. On well, I, I need to know if he's I, gonna see something. Game 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 game. I don't wanna do this. Actually, yeah, I guess... <laughs> I guess I should we go, don't know what's on the other side. through. Do it. Do yeah, it. Um, do it. I'll tell Ryan, like, do it. Do it. I'll make sure that it's safe for the for the people. And I'm going to walk go through. through like yes. Oh! <laughs> 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 and then the portal closes. <laughs> so we'll figure out where this portal oh goes my- next, next time on Nat 20. Oh, oh, God! Oh, my God! Oh, my God. The book. It's a portal hanger.